a lot of women don't have a really clear or accurate sense of their own overall risk for developing breast cancer. All women, simply by being female and getting older, have a, a certain risk of developing breast cancer, but some women, based on family history or other factors, are at higher risk. And the best way to find out what your own overall risk is and what possible recommendations apply to you would be to have a risk assessment such as uh, offered by the BPREP program here at Brigham and Women's Hospital. And that uses um, a comprehensive evaluation of a woman's lifestyle, family history, and other factors to develop a good comprehensive screening preventative plan for that patient. So for women who are at a higher than average risk for developing breast cancer, and according to the American College of Radiology, that's to have at least a 20% lifetime risk of developing breast cancer, they are appropriate candidates for having screening breast MRI. An MRI is an extremely sensitive test for detecting breast cancer. And um, according to guidelines, women at higher than average risk, as I said, should really be having annual breast MRIs as well. We have an active screening breast MRI program. Our patients are referred in from the BPREP program or the high-risk clinic for women with genetic mutations that uh, is done at Dana-Farber, women who've had a prior history of breast cancer, and sometimes women with dense breast tissue and a family history in which we know the mammogram is less sensitive. If they're at high enough risk for developing breast cancer over their lifetime, they're candidates for doing annual breast MRIs. So an MRI is um, a, a large magnet of w which patients go into. Their breasts are not compressed. The patient lies prone or on her belly on a table. And images are acquired of the breast tissue after an injection of contrast. So while every hospital has MRI units and can do a variety of different examinations on them, Brigham and Women's Hospital has a team of breast imaging subspecialists who do nothing but interpret breast imaging and do breast biopsies. And so they have a wealth of experience and knowledge um, that we offer our patients. We also have a multidisciplinary collaboration with our breast surgery team, who are also subspecialists in breast surgery, and our breast oncologists. And that collaboration amongst the disciplines provides really the most comprehensive and top-notch breast care for women.